G'day guys, my name's Nick and welcome to my channel Low Range Nick where I do videos about four wheel driving, accessory fitting and maintenance for your four wheel drive vehicle. So in today's video I'm going to be giving you a full tutorial on how to use an OBD2 scan tool to carry out diagnosis on your vehicle. So this video is sponsored by CG Sulit and they've sent me out their SC880 scan tool to carry out a test and review. So in today's video, I'm going to carry out a full test and review on the SC880 and also give you guys a full tutorial on how to use a diagnostic scan tool. So firstly, I'll carry out a bit of an unboxing of the CG Sulit SC880 and show you guys exactly what you get in the kit. So the first thing that you're going to notice is the really tough carry case that the SC880 comes in. So now I've popped open the hard carry case. What you can see here is the SC880 diagnosis scan tool. We also have the OBD2 cable down here, which quite easily connects and disconnects at the top of the unit. It also comes with a USB cable to connect the SC880 to your PC or laptop to carry out regular updates. We also get a user manual, which gives you a full set of instructions on how to use the unit. So there are a lot of different OBD2 scan tools on the market. So how do you pick a scan tool that's right for you? So firstly what we have is our basic entry level scan tools which have very limited functions. They can only really read out data and codes from the engine ECU and nothing else. Then we step up to something like the CG Sulit SC880 which is more of a dealer level diagnosis tool. So what this can do is actually read out fault codes, carry out diagnosis and also service functions with a multitude of different modules. So we can carry out diagnosis on the engine ECU, the transmission module, the ABS system, and a bunch of different systems that I'll talk about later in the video. So what we'll do now is set up the SC880 and get it plugged into the vehicle, and I can show you firsthand how to carry out diagnosis and also read live data. So now we're ready to set the unit up so we can carry out some diagnosis. So all we need to do is plug the cable into the top of the unit here, and then we just screw these two little threads into the top of the unit to retain the cable. And now we're ready to carry out some diagnosis on the vehicle. And now we just take the OBD2 cable from the scan tool and plug it into the OBD2 port in the vehicle. So now I've connected the scan tool to the vehicle and I've also turned the ignition on. Now you can see that we have a few different menu items that we can scroll through by using the arrow buttons. And we can also select them by using the tick and go back by using the back button. So what we can do first is we can basically carry out an auto VIN search for the vehicle. And what this does is automatically determines the vehicle's VIN so we can easily select the vehicle. Go into a Suzu, global area, and then we'll go down to the MUX because my vehicle is the Suzu MUX and the engine is the 4JJ1. And now what we can do is a quick scan of all of the modules in the vehicle. So what you can see now is that it's scanned through all of the modules fitted to the vehicle and checked for any fault codes. So you can see that it's passed every module in the vehicle and that there's no faults evident. So that's really good and if we did have a fault code what we could do is go further into it, carry out the report and then we'd be able to carry out some diagnosis on that particular fault code. So for now we can go back and we'll keep going back to the main menu. So another thing we can do with the SC880 is carry out some live data diagnostics. So what we can do is go into the diagnostic menu. We'll select our vehicle again. So the Isuzu MUX. For JJ1. And we can carry out a quick scan of all the modules, but that's basically what we did before with the um, quick scan with the auto VIN. So we can also go into the control modules here and specifically select the control module that we want to carry our diagnostics on. So let's just say that we had a traction control light on in the vehicle and we read the codes out 
and the code was a wheel speed sensor code. So it was saying, say, front left wheel speed sensor not picking up. What we could do with the live data is go into ABS, select ABS. We can go down to live data, data display. What we'll do is we'll scroll down the list until we find the wheel speed sensor pickups. Here we go. So you can see right rear wheel speed sensor, left rear wheel speed sensor, right front wheel speed and left front. And what we can do is read out live data. So now you can see in a list that it's reading out all of our wheel speed sensor uh, live data readouts. So what we do now is go for a short drive and we basically check these wheel speed sensor readouts and make sure that they are working perfectly. What you normally see with a failed wheel speed sensor is that you'll get three or so or maybe two that are picking up correctly and then the other one or two will be dropped out. They'll be remaining at zero. So that's a quick easy way that we can actually diagnose issues with the vehicle is by using live data. So one of the best things about the CG Sulit SC880 is the fact that you can carry out adaption resets, injector relearns, and also other service functions. So we'll go down to the maintenance menu now, and I'll show you guys some of the service functions that you can actually carry out. So we can carry out an air fuel ratio adaption reset. We can replace the airbag ECU, an ABS service and bleed. We can register batteries, carry out a DPF burn off and even reset the data. We can carry out a CVT reset, a clutch adaption, change in tire size. We can also carry out an electronic park brake disabling so we can replace the brake pads. We can carry out an EVAP test, a gear relearn, headlamp adjustment, oil reset. So a lot of modern cars have oil life resets or oil service resets that you need a scan tool to be able to reset. So the SC880 can definitely take care of that for you. You can do odometer calibration, language changes, injector coding, prime the fuel system, carry out a steering angle sensor adjustment and relearn. You can carry out a seat match, transmission oil change, turbo adaption reset, transmission relearn, throttle position sensor relearn, tire pressure monitoring system relearn, and also windows and door relearn. So it has quite a few different service functions built into the maintenance setting in this scan tool that you can carry out. And that's one of the best things about this high level scan tool is the fact that you can do some of those service functions. So another great feature is the fact that you do get lifetime free updates. So that means you can quite easily attach the USB cable to the unit, jump onto the CG Sula website and carry out the updates when they're available. So that means your scan tool will be always up to date with the latest firmware and you'll get the latest service resets and diagnostic tools. So you can also graph live data on this scan tool and you can carry out a history search of vehicles that you've previously searched and save data as well. So the CG Sula SC880 is a great unit if you're looking to carry out diagnosis on more than just the engine ECU. So some of the basic models can only really read out fault codes and live data, some basic live data that is, from the engine ECU. Whereas the high quality models like the SC880 can actually carry out diagnosis on multiple different modules like the ABS, SRS and body control module, as well as the engine ECU. So what you'll find is also you can carry out some really good live data searches and read out that live data from the control units to carry out diagnosis. You can also carry out service functions, so adaptation resets, relearns, and things like that. So if you're looking at a higher quality diagnostic tool, then the SC880 is definitely a well-priced option that can give you some of those higher quality features for really good value. So if you are interested in finding out a little bit more information about the CG Sulit SC880, or even some of the other scan tools that CG Sulit have to offer, what I'll do is drop down in the comments and description below a link to the CG Sulit website so you guys can go there and check out some more info. What I'll also have is a discount code for you guys so if you are interested in actually purchasing one of these scan tools then you'll be able to save yourself a bit of cash by using this discount code at the checkout. So thanks a lot for watching guys. If you do have any feedback or if you learned a few things from this video, or if you have some opinions or comments, let me know down in the comments below and I'll be really keen to hear your feedback. So thanks again for watching guys. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more four wheel driving, accessory fitting and maintenance videos. Cheers guys.